Hi everybody, Sarah the Koala here and welcome back to my Quick Quest series. Today's level is level 45 for the Fisherman's Quest, I Believe Fish Can Fly. So where else? We're going to go to Sisipu in the Fisherman's Guild at Limsa. You do need to be equipped to be a fisherman, so have your rod on. And you must be over level 45 or 45 to get this quest. So once accepted, just run outside the Fisherman's Guild on your left. You need to go and speak to Sybil. Now stop, before you start running off doing this quest, you do need specific bait. So if you go upstairs to Hawker's Alley, speak to the field craft supplier, which is Sydney Hill. And you need to go and buy yourself, I'll probably just buy 99 of the hover worms. So now we're prepped and ready, where do we go? So I've just opened up my map just so you can see visually where you need to go. So we want to go into Coorthus and then into the Central Highlands and just right up there on the top left you can see I'm hovering over. That's where we need to head to, that top left part there. Seeing as this quick quest we do have to get this done in five minutes or less so I am actually going to go to Camp Dragonhead. I'm going to teleport there and pay some money and then I'm going to travel there very quickly just so you can see. Now I fully appreciate maybe at this level you don't already have the flying options so I'm going to kind of steer close to the piles that you'd need to cover but it's very simple to get there anyway it's a massive stopping point that you probably have to stop with with quests in Shadowbringer anyway. As I mentioned here we get to the castle sorry I did have to speed that up it took a couple of minutes to get there and I didn't think you wanted to watch that so here we are. So when you arrive, just go outside and speak to this soldier here. I'm not going to pretend to pronounce his name. Speak to him, he is part of the quest. Now there is something I did want to bring up whilst we're here, is that because you're level 45, you have indeed opened up the sky fishing. And apparently from what I've read and what I've understood before, people get confused between the sky fishing at level 45 and the cloud fishing at level 50. That comes in at the end of the Shadowbringers chapter. This one is the sky fishing level 45 and you just need to make sure that you have sky fishing here. And of course, as you guys probably already know, if you're not already level 45, you won't have it. So follow around the castle and get to this cliff edge just to where I am. Here you can see it on my map and you can see where I'm standing. So maybe that can help you pick and choose your location. Remember to change your bait. That sounds aggressive, I'm sorry, but it needs to be reminded. <laughs> and quite simply, you fish from this cliff edge until you get all of the cloud fish that you need. Now, there are some weather restrictions. This took me around about half an hour to complete. When it was normal or clear skies like it is now, I only got one of them in the sake of, say, 10, 15 minutes, which was actually, you know, painful. But then when the clouds started coming in, usually when it's snowy or blizzardy, you actually get more of a, like, 30, 40% chance that you'll actually catch it. So I would recommend, you know, sit tight and wait rather than waste your hover fish, uh, your hover worm. Unless you've got loads like I have and then crack on, get new species. Fill in that journal. So with the power of editing, I haven't made you sit there and watch me catch five of them. Also what you'll notice is the weather has changed. This is the kind of weather I was telling you about. So we've collected five cloud cutter fish and as it says there in the big blue banner, we can now give them to Sisipu. So it's probably not a surprise when I tell you we're gonna travel back to Limsa. We're gonna to go to the Fisherman's Guild and we're gonna to speak to Sisipu. So when you hand it in, a cutscene does happen. I'll leave that for you guys in your storyline. And then you've completed your quest. And if you're lucky, you might level up as well. So thanks so much guys for watching yet another installment of my quick quest series. Hopefully I'll get level 50 out soon and that'll be the end chapter for Shadowbringers. It's been an absolute pleasure. Let me know what you think in the comments below or give us a like or a cheeky subscribe. It's completely up to you guys. But let me know what kind of videos you want next. And as always, guys, take care and I'll see you on the next one.